Welcome to Cvent Integration Training, Setting Up Webhooks in an Event. In this video, you will learn the basic steps of configuring the webhooks integration within your Cvent event. After adding a webhook configuration in admin, it can then be enabled in an event and individual sessions. To do this, go to the Integrations tab in your event. Then select Push API Integrations. A webhooks configuration will appear by default, and if you need to add multiple configurations to a single event, just click the Add Webhooks button. For now, click into the existing configuration. The setup details will appear on this page, which you can start customizing by clicking Edit. In the Basic Settings section, select Yes below Activate Webhooks for this event. Then, you'll be prompted to choose a webhook configuration. Select the desired configuration created in the admin area. Next, select which objects to sync to your endpoints. You can choose to sync one or all of them for this event if needed. For example, if you need to sync session data to your endpoints, select yes under the session object. Finally, review the integration points for the configuration you've selected. If you need to add or remove an integration point, you will need to do so in the admin area. Next, click Save. At the top of the screen, if you hover over the Actions button, you can validate the webhook at any time to ensure all endpoints are active. You'll also see a shortcut to the webhook's message history report this report returns the status of any webhook messages sent from your account and can alert you if one has failed. Next to the Actions button is the Sync button, which allows you to manually sync the webhook integration to your third-party application. Data will automatically be transferred every 15 minutes, but you can always press this button to push changes through quicker if needed. If you need to control which sessions from your event are syncing with your webhook, the final step is to move to the Sessions tab. From here, click Edit. And if needed, select the sessions by checking the box to the left of the name. Next, click Save. To see what integration points are synced to a certain session, click the arrow next to the session name. Then click Advanced Settings. This will drop you into the Advanced Settings tab of that session. Scroll down to the Webhook Integration section where you can see if the integration is active as well as its live integration points that are specific to the sessions in your event. 